Hello and welcome to Double Convex's final episode in a Creating HDR Images. This final episode deals with noise and it's uh, the bane of all HDR images. Invariably when you generate an HDR off multiple exposures you're going to bring in a certain element of grain that most color photographers call noise. Uh, in black and white it can actually be very pleasing. In color not so much and uh, I scoured the internet until I found a recommendation for a particular noise reduction program that I have since got ahead and got myself and I absolutely love it and here I am demonstrating how it works. So here is the HDR image that we last created in uh, our last episode and if you zoom in notice this is a big image that you can actually get to see the amount of noise that there is in this metal. Now the program that I use is called Noiseware and it's available from the Imagenomics website. Noiseware has some basic presets and I'm just going to go ahead and make an example out of the program, or rather use the program to make an example of how noise can be dealt with. So just go ahead, use their drop downs from their noise filter and choose out a filter for stronger color. Once you've gone ahead and selected that, go ahead and hit the Go button. And give it a few seconds to process the image. Uh, it's actually remarkably fast. It doesn't take a huge amount of time. And voila, it looks completely different. And that's the close-up view. If you were to click, it shows you the before. And release shows you the after. So you get to see the before and after images of how much there is with noise and without noise. Let's zoom out a little bit and that's the images you normally see on a screen. This is the before image with all the noise present and the after image after noise has been removed. And hence, this is why I'm going to go ahead and recommend the use of Noiseware Professional. It's an excellent piece of software for dealing with all your noise issues on not just high dynamic range photography, but regular photography as well. I hope this is useful, and check back at www.doubleconvex.com for more tips, tricks, and a daily HDR image every day.